inbound aircraft. All units within range of this transmission locate destroy enemy AA emplacement.
Guardatevi il fianco! Non indietreggiate! Continuate ad avanzare! Fateli fuori! Worth, go tell the CO we got this one. Sir, Sergeant Setzer's requesting reinforcements ASAP. <sighs> Christ, we're spread thin as it is. Okay, you and Travers go, I'll hold here. I can't stand Setzer anyway. Sergeant Dave! Where? 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 Where?
Are you two my only reinforcement? Go back to CP! Report to the Colonel! Have you encountered the enemy and lost contact with our sniper team? And get us more reinforcement! What are you waiting for? You, Travers, you fight with us! See those troopers up there? Those are Germans! Unlike the Ash guys, they know how to fight! Watch yourself! We need to find that sniper team! Somebody showed up. Stay clear of the window. There's a sniper across the way. He got Harding there. Thinks he got us both. He's been on the radio for reinforcements. You're gonna have to take the shot. Take Harding Springfield. Damn, he's gotten through. The Germans are moving in. They're trying to retake the town. Hurry! A significant enemy Stay force remains in the defensive on the outskirts of Adante. S2 is reporting that there may be a regimental level Use commander present in those defenses. All units are hereby instructed to engage those defenses with the objective of either killing or capturing that officer. Let's go! On the double! Enemy armor approaching from the north. All units are instructed to fall back to town square and provide immediate support.
Dante. Airborne reinforcements are on the way. Hold your ground till they arrive. Repeat, hold your ground. <laughs> Scott Webb, commanding officer, this is the after-action report for the 82nd Airborne, July 11th, 1943. Landed at 2230 hours under heavy fire. Airborne troops destroyed all enemy AAA emplacements in and around Adanti. Village and its environs were cleared and secured. Enemy currently retreating to the north. This operation, the first combat jump for our division, was decisive, but costly. The war has begun. Made in soon. Gentlemen, I am as surprised to be here as you are. We were not intended to support the invasion of Italy, but after steamrolling inland in what looked like an easy victory, General Clark's men have been subjected to fierce counterattacks and are taking heavy losses. The Germans withdrew their supply lines all along the Amalfi Coast, forming staging areas to support surprise counterattacks. The largest of them is located here near the Pestum Archaeological Project outside Salerno. The Germans are dug in and well protected among the ruins. We must dismantle their operations piece by piece. An enemy communications center is located to the south. Strike fast. A motor pool lies to the north. Sabotage any and all fuel supplies. Finally, we have reports that the enemy has a munitions stockpile hidden somewhere among the excavation. Find it and remove the threat. Okay. Dismissed.
Traffic is heavy. Command is instructed all units to locate and sabotage any and all enemy communications equipment.
There's our target. Travis, huh? Mm. We hit the beaches yesterday. General Clark sent me and my men up here to mock those 88s for destruction. He's got Warhawks ready and waiting to do a flyby. You airborne guys sure know how to fight. Care to join us? I know! I guarantee you, it'll be a blast. Let's move out! Scott Webb, commanding officer, this is the after-action report for Operation Avalanche, September 13th, 1943. Airborne troops assembled and were en route within 45 minutes. Landed on enemy staging area, dismantled fuel depot and combo center, liquidated materiel, and assisted in the destruction of enemy long-range artillery. Operation deemed a success. Rome is within reach. Germans retreating to the north. Guess it's time to brush up on our French.